Hey Capricorn, this is Ascension Empress with your August general reading. Thank y'all so much for your support and your patience. Thank you, thank you, thank you for booking with me. Y'all have such beautiful energy. Like all the signs, 99.99% of people who have book personals, like y'all, I can't express it enough how much I appreciate the energy, the positivity. It's just like the tribe. I feel I feel the alignment and the synchronicities between um, the two. Wow, yeah, look, y'all. Mm, that's what I'm talking about. As soon as I said the alignment and the synchronicities, I said between the two, but look, collectively, this has been happening. This has definitely been, you know, a true test for the collective. This full moon energy, this Leo energy, everybody is having to deal with this completion in their own way. They're having to deal with their karma and the lessons that they're learning themselves in a way that, you know, really balances out their energy and what spirit wants them to incorporate, okay? And um, the emphasis has really been on being patient with yourself Okay, and that's another reason why I, I just had to express so much gratitude because some of y'all, like, will wait. You will want your reading whenever, okay, whenever it, it comes. And then there's other people who are, like, rushing me, trying to throw whatever shade before the reading is even supposed to come. Okay, and so this, I mean, the Eight of Swords, the Nine of Swords, the Ten of Swords, all the Swords energy has really been a true test to see you know what we can balance our time and energy with how we can rearrange some things how we can take this you know saturn and jupiter energy and make the most of it okay the most of these lessons um, immediately i'm hearing peace and blessings manifest with every lesson learned okay erica badu my cyber keeps going like a run on and on yes on and on okay and so it's like we uh, we experience this we experienced the dinosaurs. We're going. It's not going to be the last time. It's not the first time. But I feel like that's why this justice is here because it's time now, and y'all are realizing that the temperance card has been. It's been popping out. Okay, and we have some new decks. I've been playing around with the light seers, and it's been popping out a lot in the. Yes, y'all. It's been popping out a lot in the light seers, and this eight of cups has been very, very consistent very consistent because there's this healing there's this emotional completion there's a detachment happening a lot of people are going into you know this hermit energy and realizing that they have not spent enough time pouring into themselves and balancing out you know the masculine and feminine energy so let us see spirit let us see what messages we have overlaying the reading for my capricorns what messages do we have wow the page of pentacles and the strength y'all I can't remember which sign it was, but it looks like you are standing your ground, definitely. Okay, the Seven of Wands has been playing a huge role with the collective, but this Page of Pentacles, with the strength, like someone, I get someone trying to have strength with you and this new energy, because I feel like you were exhausted, you were tired, you had no more time to wait. All right, so now here you are, like whatever other sign, showing up with Page of Pentacles, like this is what I have to offer you until you, you know, really start to see if this person is who they say they are, okay, their character especially, okay, because you're realizing we are in a time of judgment, we are in a time of justice, and you're, you're walking away from the confusion. You're walking away from the old ways of being, the old ways of thinking, and old connections that seem too familiar, that seem like they continue to offer you breadcrumbs, all right? So, I also see y'all definitely, there's those boundaries, all right? What do we need to know about the strength? Look, the nine of swords, see? Okay, and somebody, this could definitely be a Leo energy or something, mm -hmm. and there you go with the star energy, and I'm talking about Leo, and then here go Aquarius, okay? So, this, I feel like th these moon cycles this next month is going to be playing a huge role for y'all, especially this Aquarius energy, because it's, it's y'all neighbor, Okay. So, some of y'all could have some Aquarius energy. Yeah, I'm getting Mercury. Mm, that's okay. Yeah, somebody could be dealing with There is a separation here. There is a separation here. And it's interesting how I said Mercury because Mercury is about to be in Leo. So, that may be the issue. Okay, you have Leo energy here. And a lot of people are, you know, in their head as well. They're not able to handle the temperance like you are, like... Like, it's no problem. Like, this is amazing to you. This is a vacation to you. Because 
Of course. You're offering a page of pinnacle. You're not, you know, giving. You're not depleting yourself anymore. You you here with the four swords. You're like, I, I like it this way. It's healing this way. I can pour into my dreams. It can, you know, come into fruition. And I'm getting, man, I'm telling you, whatever approach this is for you with the page of pinnacles, you got this person stressed. Okay, because I'm getting they really want your attention. What do we need to know about this temperance spirit? Look, as soon as I say the moon the moon spirit is definitely emphasizing that your intuition is not failing you it's not failing you you being in this in i actually feel like it's about your intuition is being heightened and that's yep see see i feel like you can pick up on other people's emotions you may some of y'all may be dealing with the pisces or this may be an opportunity for you to really you know yeah you're like anchoring this new lifestyle this new self-care routine the way you talk to yourself the way you handle emotions the access who has access to your emotions what energy has access to your emotions okay why is the page, page of pentacles because i like that that's bold like this person holding the lion and they stress too so this lion could be hungry you don't even know you know how they might react and then the page of pentacles like here you go Okay, so there is some type of innocence in knowing at the same time, but not worry. Okay, yeah, you, you know you can't have faith and worry. Look, that's why, okay? Very wise. Some of y'all are very wise, very intuitive. And who was it? I can't was it? I would think it was Taurus. Okay, you choosing to implement this hermit. Okay, I told you, anchoring a lifestyle. Okay, I feel like... In a time of solitude or in this time of separation, because there, there is definitely a separation here. This could be somebody giving somebody papers, now I think about it. Okay, but uh, it looks like you just want peace and you're happy alone. You're like, I'd rather be alone because I, there may have been some confusion. What else do you want my Capricorns to be aware of? Yeah, I was wondering what was going on. Okay, it seemed, it seemed like there was some energy like, no trying to confuse you but but this was at the end this was at the end y'all don't let nobody project five of wands chariot still i'm telling you in those ancestor readings that chariot kept coming out along with the knight of wands just like don't be distracted keep moving forward yes people are wanting attention yes it's you know competition but there's judgment here there's judgment and it's fair that you are protecting your energy you're not in the nine of swords energy you're not in the ten of swords let the people who are in it be in it okay i'm getting you like that's not my problem what else do we need to know about this page of pentacles see two of pentacles somebody got to match your effort because you got more than one like i said you got more than one pinnacle Okay, but you need some type of reciprocity is what I'm getting. And I'm hearing until then, oh, until then, somebody just going to have to be curious. They just going to have to, you know, maybe guess what it is that you're up to because I, I see you pulling back your energy. All right. What do you want them to know about this temperance energy spirit? What look? Five of Pentacles. Yeah. Sacrificing. Somebody definitely left somebody feeling left out. You're like, but I'm not going to feel like this again. Now somebody else is feeling that way is what I'm getting with the Nine of Swords. Somebody also depleted you financially. There's a lot of fighting. There's money and court cases going on here. What do we need to know about the Two of Pentacles and the Five of Pentacles spirit? What do we... Here. Yeah. And I was going to say, and the Five of Wands. Because, oh, wow. Look, y'all, hold up. First of all. Eight of Swords and the Two of Cups and <laughs> the Seven of Wands and look, the Magician and the Four of Cups. So I get this. This is definitely an energy round. You know, no longer feeling stuck within a connection, feeling bound, letting anybody make you feel that way. I feel like y'all are connecting with some very manifesting people. Okay, because some of y'all may be in a situation or a state that you're just not, it's not emotionally fulfilling. Okay, again. I feel like somebody brought you drama. They may have underestimated you, too. They may have seen you as not having much money, as, you know, because this person does seem materialistic as well as what I'm getting with the strength card, even though they seem to be insecure. So they come off as this lion energy, and they looking at you, you know, all, they, yeah, they got so much pride in themselves, and they're looking at you like the Page of Pentacles, but yet yeah, you were the one with peace of mind. 
you the one with the four of swords okay and i'm getting you're happy and willing like and you learn like yeah you take you work with what you got and look y'all this is this is amazing and yet ooh. when you think the empress is really a page of pentacles sadly mistaken sadly and that empress has been huge for y'all y'all i know you seen that judgment okay i said sadly mistaken that's i mean rebirth and this is the, i'm hearing this is what had to happen some of y'all just decided to you know humble yourselves oh yeah you played that role you study well you were observing you were just like mm, okay okay wow look as soon as i said study well patience planning look you playing chess and you're very good at it okay very skillful the clarity like look look imagine her writing the plays planning it out having the discernment having the clarity having the patience and the judgment and the love and the humility okay the humility to show up like this amongst people yeah she sees she sees man or woman somebody's very discerning any other messages look y'all the death card that's that rebirth energy that's that judgment this is what we going through my condolences i do feel there's a maternal energy y'all been getting that taurus and i think about say i said taurus so this could definitely be a taurus okay with this empress here but y'all have a feminine energy here that may have passed away i'm getting scorpio energy too that is scorpio sagittarius too wow this is she's providing you a lot of clarity about the transformation what else do we need to know, Spirit? Ooh, yes. Ace of Cups and the Nine of Cups. Wow, that's that's a lot of fulfillment, y'all. A lot of fulfillment. Some of y'all may feel alone. You know, it may... I feel tower energy. I do. I feel like, you know, may... These wish fulfilled... It's going to come in a different way for somebody. Yeah, see? See? That's why. Because I noticed that the Nine of Cups and the Ace of Cups try to come out in reverse. And then you have this King of Cups. The, see, yeah, the King of Pentacles in reverse. So, I said the King of Cups, somebody could be really emotional or have water in their chart about, you know, career, status, security. And spirit is definitely emphasizing don't, don't let go of your emotional well-being. Okay? Because... Somebody, yeah, I definitely feel like there's this lower vibration. Somebody could be, you know, drowning in their emotions, overindulging in something, not believing. They, like, not tapping into this page of Pentacles energy or even the page of Cups for this to happen, okay? Spirit wants somebody to tap into this empress and this belief and surrender to, to this transformation, okay? Yeah, they're like, we need you to know. Ooh, yeah. Definitely. They're like, um... Get clear now because everybody else is clear. Other people see it in you. What's the overall message? That was, yeah. And there's definitely a feminine energy here, ancestor who sees it, okay? Sees it. And there's a lot of love for you. When I'm hearing as soon as you, yeah, because whoever, somebody needs to work on their gratitude exercises. Because I do get that somebody has a tendency to complain. And you may come off as this King of Swords energy, and there's a spirit here. There's someone here who's like here to offer you this love, this confirmation, this compassion. Okay, this reassurance. Well, yeah, family. I was wondering, y'all. Yeah, y'all. They want you to have faith. They said faith and worry can't, you know, can't be the same. You're taking this approach for a reason, right? Okay, so know that it is gonna pay off because you can't. Yeah, somebody's at the Page of Pentacles and. You may not want, yeah, you may not feel comfortable even going to this person, asking this person. Um, the Spirit is saying, like, if you just have faith and you pour into you, this King of Pentacles in reverse isn't going to be a problem. One more Spirit. Look, yeah. It's not going to be a problem. <laughs> I'm excited for y'all. So keep me updated. I love you all so much. Please take care. Bye.